Julius and Vincent were the youngest. Ryan and Jacobs also came down. They were brave and bright boys. But they wanted to go on adventures. <laughs> They were so desperate, in fact, that one day they set off with their wooden swords in one hand and a pillow in the other on a quest to find an enemy to fight off. They strolled over the meadows and through the forest and swam across the oceans. Okay, not, maybe not the last one, but they did jump over a very large puddle, and that in itself is a challenge. And it's that one I walk that a huge, yeah, very unstoppable. You can pair a sea and cut down was the only yes to sit in the entire forest. They found him rude and rather scary looking, therefore suitable to attack according to these two. They switched their blunt wooden thought in the air, making funny noises while doing so. Their swords were waved around for ages until Vincent dropped his sword. Of course the bear woke up by the loud noise that the boys made. So when the bear woke up, he was so angry that he picked up the sword and snapped it right in half. And I know it, that the two little dragons that stood in the way, he threw the broken sword away, nearly hitting the boys. The boys were lucky that they didn't get hurt, and they realised that fighting is never a good thing to do, because one way or another, somebody will get hurt. The boys realised that they had to apologise for wanting to hurt the bear, and agreed to make his walk more comfortable by letting the bear keep both of their clothes. The bear bite them and told them that a boy they made it help. They could help towards him because that watchman of all 